What is up, Spike? It's, uh, it is Christmas Eve, so uh, I thought I'd upload a video, which will probably be uploaded by tonight or on actual Christmas. So, <clears throat> for those of you guys that are, I don't want to say, how do I want to word this? For those of you guys that are historical figures, like, not historical figures, but, like, for those of you guys that like history, yeah, I like history. I'm going to do a history video for you guys today. Yeah, I, by the way, I had to shave my beard. I look like a baby now, but that's all right. Um, I have some facts for you about the Titanic. I wrote them down on my phone. Let me see how many I have. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have 12 facts about the Titanic. Now, two of these, two or three of these, I'm betting my life on every one of you guys know. Maybe even four. Some of you guys might even know. 99% of them, but the percentages... And the numbers, I don't think you guys will know. But I think some of the easy ones you guys will know. But, uh, so, yeah, let's get to it. Uh, for those of you guys that don't know what Titanic is, Titanic was a ship which, back in its time, was the world's biggest cruise ship. Well, ship. But, nowadays, it's kind of small. It's very small compared to modern ships nowadays. I saw a diagram on Google where the Titanic was about maybe a half of the size of this one Disney or Carnival ship. Carnival, however you say that. It was the, like, three quarters of the length, but nowhere near as tall. But, um, yeah, so Titanic back then was a major feat of engineering. But, um, and as you guys know, it hit an iceberg, which could have been avoided sinking like that if it would have kept going straight instead of trying to avoid it, which it had six warnings ahead of time, and it took that long to turn it. But yeah, so here are the 12 facts about the Titanic. The RMS Titanic. RMS stands for Royal Mail Ship. It was a mail ship. And the mail was not your typical, like, post office mail. No, the mail was the people. Royal, like, people, basically. Um, Milton S. Hershey himself was supposed to be on the Titanic, but he got struck sick and his wife would not let him go on. Um... Let me scroll down here so I don't say the same thing twice. It took not two days to sink, but it went two days. It it started to sink on April 14th, and it finished on April 15th of 1912. Um, the size of the ship was huge back then, but like I said, nowadays it is very small. Um, it was a hunt exactly 882 feet and 9 inches long. So that is about almost three football fields long. If you think about that, almost. And it cost $7,500,000 to build the ship, which isn't that expensive, if you think about it, compared to modern day ships, but still, that's a lot of money. And while building it, while building it, two workers died. I didn't look up what from, but two workers died um, during the construction of the ship. Um... Here's the part that gets me. This is why I like, I don't I don't want to say I like Titanic, but I am obsessed with the Titanic. I did a research paper on it in fifth grade. And, um, but yeah, the boat could carry 64 lifeboats and it was only equipped, it was equipped to carry 64, but it only carried 20. And my grandpa just got here, so I had to make this quick. Um, it took two hours and 40 minutes to sink the ship. Of which is a hundred two hours and forty minutes is a hundred sixty minutes to sink the ship, and thirty one point six thirty one point six percent of passengers and crew actually survived, which isn't that's like a third of the ship just about. Um, fifty three point four percent of the people could have survived given the number of spaces in the lifeboats. So that's an extra twenty point eight twenty one point eight percent that could have survived. So think about that. And lastly, 12,600 um, feet below sea level is where it lies. So that is almost, that is a little bit over two miles below sea level. So um, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys a little bit of facts about the Titanic. And um, comment below if you think I should do facts about another history event or whatever. So yeah, spec it out.